Hey guys, if you don't watch out, Android Studio can take up a lot of disk space pretty quickly. And a good way to free up some disk space on your PC is to delete some old emulators that you don't need anymore. And also the corresponding system images. For this example I have installed this API level 15 emulator. And first I want to show you what the system image is. So if I create a new emulator. In this process we had to choose a system image here. And these are the newest ones, but here we also have more. And this is for example the system image I have installed for API level 15 and as you can see there is no download button next to it anymore. This is because I have already downloaded this image and now it's on my PC and it takes up several gigabyte of space. Now let's first look how we can delete the emulator. And it's not very intuitive because from this window here I can't delete it directly. Instead we close this, we go to tools, Android and here to AVD manager. And as you can see, the emulator alone takes up 2 GB. If we want to delete it, we click on this arrow here, on delete, yes. And now the emulator is gone, but if we go into tools, Android and SDK manager and take a look into this SDK folder here on our PC and look into the system images folder, we can see that we still have the system image for API level 15. And it's 2.5 GB big, so that's not quite small. And if we want to get rid of this as well, we could either delete it directly here, but the more clean way is to do it in this SDK window here. And to see this image, we have to check this show package details box. And now when we scroll down to API level 15, we can see that this system image box here is ticked as well. When we untick it, we can click on apply. And now we get asked if we want to delete this image. We click OK, of course. And now it's deleting. Click on finish. And now when we take a look into this folder again, we can see that the folder is still there, but it's empty. So we can just delete it. This is a good way to free up some disk space. If this video was helpful, please leave a like. And if you want more Android tutorials, don't forget to subscribe. Take care.